This video is about parallax and why it's something you should think about every single time you record an angle for a montage. Now the definition of parallax is the displacement or difference of apparent position of an object viewed from two different lines of sight. To show the difference between parallax and non-parallax, if you have a camera locked on a tripod or a fixed position and it pans from left to right, the objects will appear frozen or stuck to the background. You see the foreground objects will move the same speed as the background objects. But to create parallax you actually need the camera to be moving, rather on a dolly or or a jib, or anything that causes it to move. And when the camera is moving, you're now creating different um, lines of sight as it moves, and the foreground objects will move faster than the background objects, and the midground objects will move at their own pace. This will create a more dynamic shot, and it just brings more life into the shot. Now let's use parallax to improve a shot. Here's a basic angle of just showing a character running. As you see, there's nothing in the foreground. It's kind of just a, a wider, kind of boring shot. But as soon as we add an element in the foreground, or something wiping past the camera, it becomes more dynamic, because you're creating parallax. So you can play around with this more, try to get grass in the foreground. The faster your camera moves and the more objects in your foreground, midground, and background will just improve the parallax of the shot and just really make it more interesting. 